much deserved victory against Tranmere tonight. How pleased are you with that one? Uh, buzzing, buzzing to get the three points, most importantly, and um, buzzing to get on the score sheet twice also. Let's talk about that, of course, on a personal note. How much did you enjoy being back out there and, of course, making an impact like you did today? Um, it was good. I enjoyed it, to be fair. Um, plus, I used to play, I was on loan at Tranmere as well, so I enjoyed the atmosphere. I enjoyed playing against my old team and um, just enjoyed the game overall, to be honest. I think the lads were brilliant today and um, the scoreline reflects that. Spoke about confidence, obviously, in the other press, but being a big thing in the, in the game today. So, how important was that when you got that first goal to, you know, kick on and deliver from there? No, I said earlier, I said I thought I was crap up until the first goal. So, um, getting the first goal lifted my confidence, and I felt like I couldn't do no wrong after that, and I ended up getting a second. Could add four if we'd been picky, but yeah. Because because you and the West Boys came into that game, you know, Gav said it's going to be full throttle football today. So, how much how much was that a confidence booster for you? And what was the message going into the game today? To be fair, Gav pretty much sets up full throw every game, to be honest with you. He likes to play attacking football, which is good, to be fair, with the players that we've got. We've got electric players going forward, not just myself, Glatzel, Dreno, a lot of them, um, Zach also. And um, I guess it's brilliant for Chaz being a num number nine, just getting in the box and you've got wingers with pace and getting at their full back and getting crosses in. So I guess it works good as an overall, to be honest. Touched on right there, but you are part of an exciting attacking option as we have here. So, how pleased are you to get back out there and also, you know, contribute to the team today? I think um, everyone to a man, not just the starting eleven, the bench, and the players that are not in the squad, we're all needed to be honest. Um, League Two football, we've got Saturday, Tuesday games. Rotation is good, which Gav implements, and um, we're going to need everybody. So, I'm delighted to do my part today. With the options we have, of course, how much sort of does that, you know, raise your game and your standards to, you know, make sure you're starting week in, week out? A hundred percent. I think competition is the best thing for everyone as an individual. You can't really have one bad game and slack off because you'll be out of the squad the next week. So um, it just makes everybody have a good game when they, when they get their chance to play. One thing I wanted to ask you about, of course, was the reaction for their initial equaliser. How important was that, you know, kicking on there and getting the two goals to seal us the win today? I think with the cycle that we're in at the moment, we go ahead and we end up conceding and end up either losing the game or drawing the game. So it was good character from the lads to um, put our foot on the gas and really go for it today and end up getting a, another one and another one after that. So um, credit to everybody out there, to be honest. Gav touched on you picking up a bit of a slight knock. How are you feeling? Is everything OK? Or is it just going to be so see where we are in the next few days? No, my legs are just finished, man. i got cramp. I got cramp in my calves and my hamstrings are screaming. <laughs> so I don't know. I think um rest, rest um tomorrow and then training on Thursday, Friday, kind of manage myself and then involved again on Saturday. Hopefully a similar sort of impact, you know, we're back at home, we're up against Harrogate, so an opportunity to, you know, get back-to-back -back wins on Saturday. No, of course, the county grounds are fortress, so we got to do everything we can to get our three points on Saturday and then hopefully another good performance. You touched on it being a fortress, I want to ask you that. How important is that we know, make sure that our home ground is a fortress going into the final few games of the season? No, of course, we get plus 8,000 pretty much every game, so um, we're going to need every single one of one of the fans um, in the up and coming games that we have at home to push push us going forward and getting getting results that we need. <laughs>